Good morning, Quidditch fans. It's Wednesday. I don't think I've ever recorded from this angle before. This is outside, this is obviously, because it's a window. And the light comes in, but it comes in in such a way where you can't see outside. There's not much to see outside, though. It's just a hospital. Anyway, today is Wednesday, July 6th. This video will come to you in three parts. Part 1, Concerts. New York City has a bunch of free concerts over the summer, and French the Llama, it is one hell of a set they have currently. In June, I went to see Andrew Bird kick off the Celebrate Brooklyn season of concerts in Prospect Park. He was amazing. I went to see Comedy Central Park at Summer Stage, it's the annual, um, annual stand-up event with Jim Gaffigan, who absolutely killed and then next week, Toon Yards is playing at Hudson River Park. So, if you watch this and you live in or near New York, go to that concert because Toon Yards, Meryl Garbus is amazing, amazing performer. And then they got it might be Giants on the 29th in Williamsburg, May the Staples on July 31st at Lincoln Center out of doors. Oh, it's going to be a great, great summer. And then. End of summer, August 27th and 28th, they have the Afro Punk Festival in Brooklyn. They have Janelle Monet and CeeLo Green and Reggie Watts and Santa Gold. Ah, oh, crazy lineup. Part two. What is part two? Yeah, part two podcast. I was supposed to appear on the wonderful Nerd Fighterly podcast called French the Podcast um, this week, but the editing process kind of got a little screwy, so. I won't be appearing in that edition, but I will be appearing in one prospectively in a couple of weeks. So yeah, I'm going to put a link to them in the doobly-doo as well. Part three is this week's theme, which is games. Specifically word games, because I love word games. Like, a lot. Along with Scrabble, which is... That's probably the go-to board game at this point for me. There's Boggle. Ugh. Excuse me. A game called Jambalaya, which I love because it's not a crossword game, it's a word jumble game. And it was voted um, a Mensa Award game, Games Magazine Award, Award Game of the Year a couple years ago. And that's an awesome game, put a link to that as well in the Grand Duchy of Descriptistan. I'm playing Words with Friends on my iPod. Good ladder games on Sporkle. Sporkle games in general I love, but either like word games or like popular culture quizzes are my two, um, those are the two areas of my expertise. Of course, there are other just classic non-word games like Uno, which for some reason comes to mind first, Yahtzee, Super Mario Brothers 2, Six Golden Coins, which is probably my favorite game for the Game Boy ever. And I didn't get into playing with PS2 until I was like 13, so, and even then, my brother played most of the time. I just played like sports games like Madden and, and the NHL games and stuff, so. Yeah. Those are the games that I love playing. Let's go to the hat of choosing. I'm not going to sing a song this week. i got to conserve my voice because i got to record the um, Thursday Trivia podcast tonight. Okay. Uh-oh. You're the YouTubers, so... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. I guess if someone can assist me in telling me what I'm supposed to do with this, I think you're supposed to challenge us to answer questions and stuff. So leave stuff in comments. And Robin, I'll see you tomorrow.